everyone, welcome to Sitting Down with Julie Brown. Hello, Julie, how are you today? Very good, and nice to be here with you, Rebecca. Yeah. So you're a marketing and personal development teacher at Santa Barbara City College. Yes, I'm lucky to teach in both disciplines. What made you decide to become a teacher? Well, um, when I was younger, I looked and listened to myself, and I wanted to identify a vocation, which is a call or a desire to make a difference in your work, rather than an occupation where you just rent your space for time. And I just felt that if I was a teacher, I could make a difference in the lives of others as well as my own life. How would you describe your teaching method and style? I would say uh, it's a combination of all the three traditional styles, kinesthetic, auditory, and visual. And my own personal belief that if you create a safety uh, kind of a system uh, in a classroom, learning comes naturally and risk taking occurs. Just as um, when we learned how to know our alphabet, learning, it, it becomes easy. And so I, I like to make people feel that learning is a pleasure. I'm not an easy teacher, but I make learning easy. So what benefit do you think your students get out of this? I think that they get a sense um, that they can participate and risk and challenge their own thought processes, do critical and creative thinking, and not just you know learn from the text or from me, but from each other. Thank you. We're going to take a short little break right now, but we'll be right back and we're going to talk about our products that we're working on right now. That's great. Welcome back everyone to Sitting Down with Julie Brown. So Julie, you are working on a very interesting product this semester for you students. So could you tell us more about it? Yes, I'd love to. Um, we're going to have the first annual International Fashion Flair event, which uh, the International Student Office and my students are all participating and uh, creating to uh, showcase um, what students can do in terms of event planning and looking inside themselves to be able to work together in teams. We're going to have two fashion shows. Uh, one will be at 5 o'clock on November 21st and in the BC Forum. The second will be at 7.30. They're both eclectic. We will have the theater arts department um, costuming some of our uh, models who are all students and also students from around the world if they have their own native um, you know, uh, attire, they'll be wearing it, and then some are just going to share their sense of fashion, and we're just going to have fun and a wonderful learning experience. Nice. So this show is for everyone? It's for everyone. Yeah. So I have one last question for you. Okay. I, if you could change three things in the world, what would it be and why? To have that kind of power would be amazing, and uh, I, first off, I think I would want human beings to be more empathetic and to really put themselves in another's um, life and treat each other with kindness. Number two, I would make education um, available to everyone and, and affordability would not uh, be a factor because after one got their degree they would continue to um, use that education and help others in their society. And three, I would just make people thankful for the opportunity to live and share and love. Good. Thank you for coming over here. We really appreciate it and thank you viewers for watching.